Hey, what's up, you guys? My name is Emma. Today, I'll be reacting to Fruits Basket, the final season, episode two. Anyways, let's get started with this episode on the count of three, two, one, now. Oh. It's loud in my ear, but we're all good. Okay, starting here. If I'm holding up, you see this, it's fine. Don't worry about it. <laughs> Ah, oh, the flowers. Mm. That's an unwavering truth. Okay. Oh. Okay, back with Akito, actually. To the opening, though. I love this opening. <laughs> like, I, I like it a lot. Sorry for the lack of videos, by the way, and an untimely schedule. I don't know. My life's been interesting and weird. That's what I'm going to say. Definitely not like my month and a half of a video every day. That probably took a lot out of me, too, to be honest. Ooh, but I can't wait. Oh my god, I'm like... I, I'm still bursting off that energy. Like, I genuinely am sitting here just excited and scared at the same time. Also, if any of you did see my opening reaction, uh, the ending is, is, is coming. I Another thing that I recorded, but it's, it's just taking time. Because I recorded it literally the same day. Just, yeah, aw, oh, Kagura. <laughs> to be honest, I don't even know if move, holding this closer does anything, by the way. It does a little bit, but not a lot. Whew, okay. I hate that it says the final. <laughs> the graduation ceremony. Seniors. It does, doesn't it? Huh? Nope, she's she's backing out. Okay, Shigure, what's up with you here? I imagine. Mm-hmm. It's not your fault, Toru. You're still going through the reeling emotions from it all. Machi, hell yeah. Oh. Oh, Momiji. I'm glad. Nope. Oh. <laughs> Don't just repeat it. I'm sorry. It's just his magical trait. It's a mystery. Oh. Oh. 
everything just feels like you're walking on eggshells. Yeah. They'll have varying reactions, but... Um, okay, you three. What did you just do and why? Thieves, what did they steal? Yeah, what? Oh, come on. Can those three chill out? Come on, I defend you, Motoko. This is too much, okay? Sorry, it took a second for me to get her name back in my head. They did. <laughs> Hanajima, get them. Yeah, she doesn't necessarily get anything from it. Yeah, he's already gone. Oh my god, they're gone too? Oh my god, Kyo, your fan club is here. <laughs> I'm sorry, you guys, but th that's not gonna happen. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Now we have to make more. That is true. Are you fueled to go get them now? <laughs> You'll find them. <laughs> Soft on crime. True. Oh my god. <laughs> if you require firepower, she's always here to assist you. Ah, come on. Like, I love Yuki, but they cut that scene off. Is everyone going to reject the help? He just wants to help you guys. Like, it's, it's nothing too personal. Oh my god, it's Machi! <laughs> it's hard to find you? Exactly! Oh my god, I love her. Of course not, not at all! <laughs> Come on, Machi, you got this! Oh my god, her face! Can you please say patrolling? You're holding the flower, too? This is personal, Yuki. She needs to say it now. Of course she did. Oh, blushing Yuki. Oh. <laughs> Come on, Machi, let's not resort to violence. <laughs> They're the ones I made. 
I don't know. Maybe, Yuki, maybe it was because she gripped them so hard. You never know. That's possible. Oh, Toru. Okay. Don't ask me hypothetical questions. Oh no, that face on Toru, it's not good. Oh, there's so much you don't know, Kyo. Oh, Kyo, you're trying so hard. Flower. Oh, there's so much. Toru deserves all the hugs, okay? And they're all back! Come on, you guys. There's a moment here. And Toru's kind of... Hmm... Humane this time. Oh god. Mm. No, no, I, I'm genuinely curious. What were you thinking there, Toru? Yeah, it's been a minute, right? I'm so sorry, but life can be hard. Every time we see her, she's like getting hurt by freaking sugar, eh? Hmm. With my parents! I'm afraid I do have parents. Chosen guests, okay. Between you and Richon? <laughs> Oh. 
Over 20, I think. Hmm? Oh, Akito. Just a hunch, a little tiny thought. always been away. Okay. I, I I don't think he the, like I'm trying to be serious here, but that woman though.
She's had enough of that. Okay, we still have more. Absent kids again, yeah. Yeah, something's going on with her there. We don't know where Isisu is. She has friends, freaking gossipers. Okay. Now the episode's over. Okay. That that was a lot to take in. And now it has the flower. Was that there the first time? I don't remember. I, I now actually have to look again. But if it wasn't, that's a nice little touch. But okay, okay. Um. I'm sorry, I have to admire the artwork here all the time. Uh, once again, in that reaction, I have not uploaded yet. Haven't finished editing it. I I really love this so much. I I love that they had the idea to have the creators' artwork in the ED. It's amazing. Oh. Also, Momiji grown up. Damn. <laughs> There's so much I could say, honestly, about Shigure Akito and the stuff Toru's going through. It's just hard to put in thought, and I just want more of this already, you know? It, it's like this constant battle going on. What's, hang on, hold on. What's the next episode? I hope it snows soon. Is that Machi's voice? It's gonna take me a second to get used to all their voices again, too. I used to be like, I know who's talking, but now I'm not as great at it. But I think that possibly is Machi, but I've been wrong. I've been terribly wrong before. So, I hope it snows soon. The, okay, let, let's talk about the more, like, happy stuff before we get into the more serious real quick. I really loved... The little bit of humor, and we got to see the Prince Yuki fan club again, because we are moving towards our senior year, and they'll eventually be graduating. It's, it's coming fast. Like, it, it happens quick. I, as someone who had that just recently happen to me, yeah, the time seems to fly. Um, and, you know, the fun moments, like, again, like, the, the, the club, the <laughs> student council president, like, you know, former Makoto Takei. Takai? I'm one of those. <laughs> you know, they're all like sobbing in distress, like, oh my god. And we got to see Haru and Momiji today, but I, I don't want to say that's 
some of the more fun stuff because of the context Toru's currently going through. Machi, though, scout like, searching around the school. She is bolting around the school campus going, where the hell did Yuki go? I saw him in the window five seconds ago. Where did he go? Not knowing where he's going or how to predict his route, his destination. Just like, where is he? <laughs> and, like, just chasing, chasing him with a flower in the hand. And then, you know, he feels so much gratitude and just their blushing faces. So he, like, pats her on the head and then she's, like, smack and just ends up, he gets the flower that's, uh, in his words, worse than his own. <laughs> so I I love them and I, it was just nice. And I, I guess, once again, this, this had more serious stuff going on in it with Toru. She doesn't know who she could tell, if she should tell anyone right now. She's so confused and kind of lost, and it's understandable. She was given, like, every bit of information ever possible in that one conversation. And not only that, but it also results in her not being able to do what she went there for. To convince Kurano, well, she didn't go there to talk to him in the first place, but if she's going to talk to him, she she wants him to see Uo. And, and that was pretty much not possible. And, you know, all that other fun stuff she learns. And it's really eating at her. Every conversation she has, she's, like, on this verge of crying. And with Kyo in particular in that moment, she genuinely didn't know what to do. She was freezing. She couldn't look up. And Kyo, being the good boy he is, was just like, he's a flower. You know, like, he he was so upset with himself for there. He's like, I didn't, no, I didn't mean to make you upset. No, and just freaking out. And, you know, classic Kyo stuff before um, everyone decided to come back all of a sudden. Um, no. Akito, I despised the hell out of Akito, okay? I did. Uh, I, I don't really do anymore. Like, if you could tell from my stop being mean occasionally, like, look on my face. It just, you can't forgive Akito's actions <laughs> a lot. But because you can see where it most likely for sure stemmed from, you kind of think about it and look at it in a perspective where it's like, this is, this is abuse. This is abuse. But in Akito's mind, this is the only way. Because how else are you supposed to get love and affection? Her mom literally was like, I don't need you. She doesn't give a damn. And that, and, you know, honestly, the second I learned about Ren, and read even the, the tiniest of bits about Ren, and saw even the tiniest bits of interaction, I was kind of like, damn, I didn't think I would be rooting for Akito. And now I am. <sighs> and Shigure, you, you can see some of where he's coming from. You can. But man... Is that messed up and harsh? Like, he says, you sure, you know, like, deny your womanhood, this and that, but you sure, you, you're quick to use it on me. Um, well, he, he pulls a similar tactic, uh, not about, you know, certain things, but he, he's doing a similar thing. He's like, I love her so much that I want to spoil her, like, spoil her rotten, or I want to crush her. She doesn't need more of the second one. Um. Honestly, literally anything goes wrong. That's it's a pretty critical blow to her mentally. But no, no, no. I, I think I'm gonna end this here before I ramble too long and can't get this out to you guys. So I hope you have a great day or night, whatever the heck you're watching this. And let me know your thoughts about this episode and what you're most uh, looking forward to. I'm honestly there's something in particular that I really want to see, but that's happening more towards the end. So I'm not gonna say. Because not everyone here has at least read through the manga once. But I know a lot of people have. Which is good. I'm so glad I did when I did. Even if I can't remember all of it now. Doesn't mean I'm not excited for the stuff I do remember though. But no, no. This episode was cute yet serious. And it hit all the right notes. But I hope you have a great day and I'll see you later.